It's a growing trend you've seen reported right here on CBS 2 News, and parents and teachers aren't happy about it. It's called sexting, when young people send inappropriate text messages or even nude photographs of themselves over their cell phones. This morning, our experts at Good Housekeeping have a warning for parents. CBS 2's Suzanne Rico reports. For many teens, texting is a major part of their lives. So is flirting. But when you combine the two, it's called sexting. More and more kids that send uh, nude photos to some other kids can be considered peddling child porn, and this is illegal. Sexters may face jail time and have to register as a sex offender in their state. While 22% of teens admit they've sent racy photos to their friends, most don't consider it a crime. They didn't take it as seriously. Right. Like They were like laughing about it. Experts agree that it's up to the parents to educate their kids about the negative impact sexting could have on the rest of their lives. These electronic images can live on forever and can really impact everything from their school career to their working career later in life. We have a great rule, golden rule. If grandma objects to the picture, don't post it. Suzanne Rico, CBS 2 News. Good Housekeeping says one in five teenagers has sent nude or partially nude pictures to other students.